There you go, Manatee Springs State Park. Hello. I called about the tent site. We want to pull up ahead of that van, just pull up a little bit. We're going to register you inside here for a bit. Okay. And we'll take you inside here. Okay. <laughs> All right. Very good. <laughs> you know, someone already offered me that. Hey, I have a couple of battle boards, so we can go battle boarding. <laughs> Yeah, I hope that I see this guy again. Someone already asked, is that Australian accent? They said, it's European accent. <laughs> I'm not sure where I'm heading, but let's try to ride around. I know they have beautiful springs. Just have to find it. There you go, and found the springs. Let's look at this. So cool. These are cypress trees. Look at this giant tree. Very cool. Absolutely beautiful. And this is called Manatee Springs. Tons of uh, turkey watches. So beautiful. I guess I have to be. He's growing out of cypress tree roots. Side and really had a good yeah, this is so cool. It's a big one. Bunch of hyper kids a little bit ago. Yeah, we can just enjoy it. Similar up into the crotch of that tree, a small one, but maybe it's a water snake. But it's big. A mother sure is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Female and then the males. Oh yeah. Ooh, lower. And we're not seeing it. We're looking. <laughs> Do you see it? I think that I need what a snake. Yep, one is up on a tree. Where? Look at this ice and diamond head. Now I'm heading back to my campsite. I'm gonna make my dinner, make some food, and getting ready for a night. Anyway, I'm back now.
anyway i'm gonna finish up my video now and see you in the morning good morning <laughs> i'm heading to fanning springs and um yeah i'm with ken he was uh, my neighbor here in this manatee springs park so um we're gonna go and uh, check out the fanning springs nearby and we're gonna go together so it's gonna be fun all right hey we are in um, fanning springs and i'm with ken <laughs> so we are checking out the fanning springs and we are neighbors in the Oh. Manatee Springs. Yes, Manatee Springs. So we came here to check out the um, Fanning Springs. They brought this here. Yes, I think they did. Let's just preserve the old bridge. Somebody decided it was interesting and they decided to keep part of it. Yeah, it is interesting. Way down upon the Souvenir River. Do you know that Florida State song? Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Way oh, that, down the Swanee River. That's. Here you go. I found the springs. Looks pretty. So we have some birds here. So, what's the name of it? Redbud. Redbud. And the uh, chipping sparrow is right there. There are a bunch of them. Mm -hmm. The redbud genus is Cercis. C E R C I S. Yeah, you know all the days. That's your expertise. <laughs> are you seeing the. the I'm seeing right in the middle of the flowering tree. Okay. Oh, yes. Oh, that's actually a beautiful picture, isn't it? Absolutely. It's kind of reddish. Mm -hmm. Is that a fox squirrel? I but don't know if... Uh, so I think a fox squirrel is being a little bit larger. Yeah, but it has a white belly. Look. Uh -huh. Not a gray. Not a gray. And I don't know. I should know, but I don't. Uh, yeah, I should. If the fox and the gray will hybridize. That might be the case too, because... The, the fox squirrel that I saw had uh, different kind of ears and it mm -hmm. was larger, but it does have white belly and reddish coat. Yeah. So no climbing or jumping. I wouldn't jump anyway. <laughs> but look at the water color, it's so clear. From here to that big Cypress, yeah, that would be just, fun. Then drop right in the middle. Yeah. The part and look at that uh, spring. Absolutely gorgeous, yeah. Almost it's like green, almost yeah. green. It's a sort of a light uh, turquoise. Uh -huh. I mean, what is so clear, you can see everything. So this one is old. Five, six hundred years old. That's a Carolina Wren. Yep. Are we hearing the robins? No. A good shot. Oh, look at these turtles. Do you have a lens that takes out the polarizers? Yeah, I can see the turtles. <laughs> One is taking off. Yeah. What's the name of it again? It's called water lettuce. Because it looks like lettuce leaves, mm -hmm. and the genus is Pistacia. So I need to learn more about the plants. <laughs> All right, you and I go out together, and you can teach me the birds. Or... <laughs> Do you know why the cypress trees has those? Uh, the knees are there for aeration. Oh. So the roots of the cypress would drown, and the tree would die. The roots of the tree would die from lack of oxygen, because they're in the soil and flooded. So. The each knee is filled with uh, cells of the tree that are called erinchyma. Mm -hmm. The cells are very large and they are specifically there to absorb oxygen. I heard that they don't really know. No, they know very well and you can dissect out and you can see the tissue in those knees is very different. 
from the tissue in the rest of the tree yeah. for the normal small cells. Those roots can't live unless they have these knees that are absorbing oxygen. It makes sense. Yeah. This is so cool. Look at all those knees. What would I see if it was a parula? Would it be entirely different? Yes. Parula would have a yellow breast, wing parts, and no stripes like that. Um, parula always has green back. That's one of those field marks. Very cool. 250 miles? <laughs> wow. That is amazing. I said two miles per hour. And I wrote a song. That's a great idea.